Muscle Car Museum right around the corner from my house. They're having a Ford and Mustang car show, so ooh, hopefully get some ideas for the new F100. So let's go ahead and jump right into this thing. Like it is a Ford slash Mustang show. So there's gonna be more Mustangs, but there's so much fun stuff here. I'm not gonna the show's gonna end before I get done doing everything I want to do here. Seeing all the cars. So much good stuff. I haven't been to the car show in so long. I'm amped. Apparently I'm not the only 60s era F 100 who's doing the Crown Vic chassis swap. Somebody else in town do it. I'm hoping I can find the owner of this vehicle because this thing is sweet. A little different than what I'm doing with my F100. I'm gonna be doing the body on the chassis. They cut the firewall out and put the whole interior for the F100 on this one, and they nailed it. They did a fantastic job in this truck. This thing is awesome. If this is your vehicle and you happen to find me on the channel, tag me. I wanna meet you in person. Let's check out the rest of the show. GT40. <laughs> awesome. So cool. Yo, this place is nuts. This is the inside of a local museum, a private collection. For this is somebody who absolutely live around my area. This place, I mean, look, look, nothing but GT40s. This is just the front showroom. This place has got a whole backside with a whole bunch of other cars. This is awesome show is flipping fantastic. They threw it together pretty quick and it looks good. Tons and tons of Mustangs, all sorts of horsepower things put on the show and it is flipping, flipping phenomenal. Got me thinking though, it's still kind of a small show, decent amount of cars, but they turn out kind of mediocre. Is car culture dying? Is it dead now that we're going to all electric cars? Is it just Florida? The car scene here is a little weird, a lot of more imports than they are muscle cars, but still good most car showing. I don't know, what are you guys thoughts? Put in the comments below. Is, is Do you think that car culture is slowly dying now that we're going the way of EV? I think I'm wrong, EVs are really cool, but it's, it just don't quite have the same flair that you know muscle cars do. I mean, these two rare Mustangs behind me are flipping awesome, and they're barely anything compared to the collection that is in this building. Is car culture dying or is it just transforming into something different now that we're going to EVs? Uh, car, the car shows for me is just more than just the way they look, how they sound, how they feel, the rumble of the V8s or even imports. I'll go there. That's what you're into. That's cool. But it's way different. EVs, I mean, think about NASCAR. You go to the NASCAR race, it's about the, the power, the cars ripping by. And now it's going to be, you know. Yeah, they might be 200 miles an hour and accelerate, accelerate zero to 60 a lot faster, but there's more to it than just the look and the efficiency. In 20 to 30 years, is the car scene gonna be completely different, dominated by EV cars, Teslas, the new Mach E's lineups, the Ford Lightnings? I'm wrong. Car culture has changed. There's not as much we can do now to cars because they've changed, fixed so much. Before, in the 90s, Early 2000s, if you wanted to buy a car with a good amount of power, you had to buy it and build it yourself. Now, you can go buy a Hellcat with no problems whatsoever. That's a big deal. The manufacturers have given us what we asked for, finally. But it also kind of sinks because now I can't really mess with my car as much. I can put lights on it, maybe lower a little bit. There's not a lot of stuff I can do to a car nowadays other than minor tweaks, which is great, but eh, kind of takes the fun out of it. I really want to wrench on something. It's 
it's a big difference. So I'm wrong. I'm all for my technology, EFI. I mean, I put Sniper Kit on my the Camaro. I mean, come on. But it's still something that is changing. And now that we're going with EVs more lately, that's a whole nother topic that is changing the car scene. And I'm wrong. I'm all for the EV vehicles. They're just not quite the same flair as in a original muscle car. Even a late 80s car, which those cars weren't exactly the greatest, but they have a place to stand more than EV in my eyes. I can still do things with them. EVs are good for day-to-day -day use, but what about the weekend car? You know, these old school cars are slowly withering away or becoming way more expensive to get because they don't make them anymore. They're so hard to get. Only time's gonna tell. Thanks for watching, guys. Till next time, peace. Go work on your project cars.